All right, let's go. All right. We'll do some cruising. For bruising. Just cruising around. Cruising with the top down. This sunny May 2nd, 2021. Gonna go out and see if we can find the best fried clam in the land. Get some fried seafood. Right. Find a place to do that. Yeah. I'm not sure where we're gonna go. Go this way. Stop down the little store down here. Pick up some claws. Some gas while we're here. He's showing me the window we put in where he had some other guy too. Yeah. Townie. He doesn't, he doesn't like the new guys that they got. Alright, we just fueled up. Got some white claws for the ride. Uh, Mr. Nick over here likes his white claws. I certainly do. Yeah. It's a lot better than beer sometimes. I mean, I don't drink much beer anymore like I used to. You're above the law with the claw. Above the law. So I'm thinking we'll just go for a ride. What do you think? Sounds like a good plan to me.
try to get lost. I mean, back in the day, without a map book, an atlas, road atlas, if you did get lost, you truly got lost. I mean, nowadays with GPS, it's kind of hard to get lost. But yeah. finally found a place this way Nick Nick's got to use the use the bathroom and yes. we needed a uh, place where we could refresh ourselves so we're at the Lammy's Old Salt restaurant Is this the line right here? No, no, go ahead. They're just gonna come get us. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Let's see if we can hit the bar. Excuse me. Hi. Now let's see what we can find here. Can just see it ourselves or? Do we um in in there just seat ourselves? Or? Yeah. Okay, perfect. All right, so let's let's go in here and see what we can find. Oh, there's a table under the TV over there too. I think that's what we're gonna do. We'll wait for Nick. Come in. That's what we're gonna do. Maybe I'll just kind of sit down here. That's what I'll do. So over here, under the table, or under the TV, I mean. <clears throat> Looks like a good spot to be. I don't know. Hey, Nick. Here he comes. There he is. He's the, the El Bandito. Yeah. Gotta rob you. El Bandito. Stick him up, will ya? So we got a table right under the uh, right under the TV. I'll be over just a minute, okay? Perfect. For your own beer over there. Yeah. Right. Right on. So yeah, here we are. Um, we're at a place called the Old Salt. I believe we're in Hampton. Hampton. And, uh, hopefully they got them fried clams. Yeah, they do. Oh, oh yeah. I'll get some fried clams. Uh, some of the best seafood up here. In the Northeast. Cold water of the Atlantic Ocean. 
it um, it makes the uh, seafood, in my opinion, taste better. How's it going, guys? Good. How are you? Good. My name is Monica. I'll be taking care of you today. Monica. I want somebody to drink for you. Um, yeah, I'll have. How about um, Crown on the Rocks for me? Sounds good to me. We have a. Uh, be right back, Thank you. What do you got there, Nick? The wine list? Yeah, so uh, Nick forced me to pull over and find an establishment where we could get a drink. Right, Nick? We were thirsty. <laughs> yeah, we've done a lot of driving. Um, we actually drove to the beach and uh, we didn't uh, do any filming there because we couldn't find a place. There were literally lines out the door at every establishment we went by. So we just came inland about a couple miles from the ocean and we found uh, this place here. So we're going to check it out. And I'm, I've been on the hunt for fried clams. Right? Yeah, so we found a place. Hopefully the food will be good here. But, um, yeah, we're going to check it out. The Old Salt. And we're in Hampton. 490 Lafayette Road in Hampton, New Hampshire. They have a gluten-free menu available. I'm not sure what's on that, but I'm not concerned with that at this point. Get some food. But first, the drinks. Yes, sir. There's Nick over there. This is serious business. Serious business. Deciding what to get. Right? Yeah, I'm with you, Nick. It's actually easier for me to move this around with it in my hand. They got the ball game on. There's all kinds of uh, local memorabilia, Bruins, and New England Patriots. Stuff on the walls. There's the bar over there. Which... All kinds of sports stuff going on. I don't know. Wait, Red Sox. Here comes the drinks. And I will be back in just a minute, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. All right, now we're in business. So look, we got our drinks here, a little Crown Royal. Nick's got a Captain and Coke. I think it's uh, for our long journey here. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Taste this. You can't really go wrong with whiskey on the rocks. I mean, it's pretty good to me. The microphone's working. It's pretty loud in here. A lot of chatter going on. A lot of chatter. A lot of chatter. A lot of happy people. That's all right. We we can join in with the happy people. Join in with the happy people as well. We got our our uh, waitress Monica. Yeah, so you know when you're traveling in the Northeast here in the United States, you have to come up and try the seafood. Not that the seafood down south is uh, is bad because it's good, but there is something about the cold Atlantic water here that makes the, uh, the seafood good. The lobsters. It's the best seafood. Yeah. I would agree. North Atlantic. Yeah. What's that? North Atlantic. Seafood. Best. I would think it's the best in the world. I haven't been around the whole world, but... I like, I like the, a good grouper in Florida. It's not quite oh, the same. it's like I said, not that the... Not that the seafood down south is bad because it's not. Um, the mahi mahi down there and the dolphin and uh, shrimp are really good down south. 
You know, there's nowhere to get the kind of lobster that we have up here. Um, North Atlantic lobster, they put two claws on them. And they're hard shelled and they're just really, really good. Yeah. Clams are good here. The haddock, if you like white fish, haddock or codfish, some of the best around. I think I'm gonna finish up here really quick until we get the food. When we get the food coming back, I'll turn the uh, camera back on. So, see you guys in a minute. See you later. Have we had any what? Have you had any luck looking at the menu? Oh, yeah, we're done looking. Ready when you are? Yeah. Uh, let's start with um, a dozen oysters. Get those lived as an appetizer. Okay. We decided to go with oysters, so they should be good. Good night. Good night ahead of you. Right. <laughs> and then I'm going to have uh, the clam plate. Fries and coleslaw? Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I guess. You can do baked potato, garlic mash, we have chips, onion rings are 99 cents extra. No, the, no, the fries and coleslaw. Fries and yeah, fries and coleslaw. This is Monica, by the way. She's our, she's our waitress today. <laughs> I'd like the same thing, please. Clam dinner? Yep. So, Alright, I'm going to go put those oysters in. It'll just be a few minutes, okay? Awesome, and I'll thank take you. the menu yep. to get them out of your way. Right on. So, yeah, so... Yeah. We decided um, we'll get some uh, oysters on the half shell. Why not? Why not? Nick Just says, down. why not? Delicious. You know, horseradish. When in uh, Rome, as they say, you gotta have it. do as the Romans, and we're here. So we don't even have to shock them. No, that's perfect. No, when they when they bring them, you're gonna see them. They're. Uh, I'm sure they're really delicious. They'll be delicious. They will be delicious. So, oysters came. Oysters are here. Do you want a couple of side plates or anything? No, we're good. All right, I'll Thank bring your you. meals in a few minutes. Can you get a chance to Perfect, yep. Yeah. So, there they are. We got the oysters. Nick's going to have one. Do the in. What do you think, Nick? A little uh, cocktail sauce on that. Horseradish. Some horseradish. Squirt a lemon on there. Alright, tell me how it is. Is it good? Alright. Very good. Alright, so I gotta try. Get my fork right here. Take this one right here. Ready to go. So, a little, little cocktail sauce on there. Some horseradish. And a squeeze of the lemon. Squeeze some lemon on there. Alright. Make sure it's uh, so the muscle attaches to the to the shell. So you gotta make sure that you get that off, so it'll be smooth. So here, let's try this out. Those are really good. Yep, I approve. Yep. Nikki approve. Yep. Very good. So good. I think I'm gonna have another one. Some of this cocktail sauce on there. Spread it out. A little bit of the horseradish is spicy, but it's not too bad. Not too bad at all. And then a little bit of the lemon on there. Let's try this out. Let's do another one. Pearl? <laughs> yeah, I got a little bit of the shell in there. I had some shells stuck in there, so I didn't want to go chomping down on that, but... Yeah, they're so good. These are very good. A little bit of 
whiskey to follow it up. I'm going to have, uh, you know, a couple of these oysters. You know, all the half cheap. How are the oysters, guys? They're excellent. Fantastic. Yeah. So, uh, some people would say these are an aphrodisiac. I don't know about that. But I do know that they taste really good. <laughs> I've been told that they put, you know, they put that lead in your pencil, or yeah. give you that, give you that oomph in your, uh, oomph in your hoop. in your your man, uh, your manliness. <laughs> but uh, I don't know. I just know that they taste really good. So. Um. Nick wants to do an oyster toast. So we're, we're gonna do an oyster toast. So I gotta get my seasonings on there. Okay. So here, oh, hold on. Camera stuck on the table. All right, so here we go. Here's to a great adventure day. Yeah. Sunday fun day. Sunday fun day. Sunday fun day. Cheers, Nick. Wow. Horseradish. Get some sinuses open. We made quick work of those oysters. We sure did. Tasty oysters. And there's more to come. The fried clams will be out next. We're going to have that. So get those here coming up soon. Stand by for some fried clams. So Monica, our, our waitress, was telling us it's uh, there's an inn here. What'd she say? 30, 32, rooms. 32 rooms. So which is kind of cool. I didn't really realize that. We were reading the uh, the placemat, and uh, it used to be an inn, and apparently it still is. So I guess two brothers own it, and um, one of the brothers runs the restaurant and the tavern, and the other one runs the inn so yeah you know it might be a cool place to stay at of course if you have a little too much to drink get yourself a room and you don't have to drive which is a good thing perfect what's that perfect yeah perfect is right i agree but uh yeah the old salt at lammy's inn you can see that or not. It says it right there. Build salt at Lammy's Inn. I guess uh, Eisenhower, he was here. At least he ate here. Dwight Eisenhower ate here. So they got that going for him, you know? Yeah. It's a historic spot. Yeah, it's kind of cool. I'm sure it's been here for a while. I'm not sure what year that was, but it was probably in the 50s or the early 60s. It's been a while since uh, Ike was around. Hey, then, are we going to finish that sandwich? Yeah, hey, can I have the rest of that sandwich? <laughs> hey, can I try that? Are they, they're done with that? Can I try it? Yeah, are they done with that sandwich? Cause, uh, I just want to bite. Yeah. It looks pretty good. Yeah, it's good. I don't want to get one if I'm If you're going to throw that away, you want to wrap that up? Yeah. I'll take that. A little go bag. Yeah. Oh, they didn't want that? No. I want I, that. Yeah, can I have it? What is that? Just cut off the parts they bit. Yeah, uh, Yeah. take off the the, the, uh, the teeth marks. Yeah. Cut them off. <laughs> the teeth marks. I'm good with that. Are you good with that? I'm fine with that. I want it. it smells like a good fish sandwich. Right on. Alright, we'll be back with clams. Rumor has it the clams are on the way. 
Look at that. Awesome. Yeah, Monica go. came in with all of the food. Do what I can, and I'll be right back with the drink. All right, Do you guys thank you. Do you have any extra tartar or anything? Uh, no. Okay, I don't for now? So. Yeah. yeah. Look at that. Fried clams. Fried clams. Full belly fried clams. We got french fries and uh, coleslaw. It all looks very delicious. I'm excited. Comes with uh, tartar, tartar sauce, which we'll open that up. And then we got some ketchup for the fries. So let's see. Let's see how this is going to be. I'm just going to use my hands. Put some tartar on that. I'm going to eat that up. It looks delicious. That's really good. What do you think, Nick? That's excellent. Really good. Got to get the whole belly. Yeah, whole belly clams. You can buy the strips, which are just the necks. Yeah, no. If you're a real New Englander, you get whole belly clams. Good way to go. So good. Very good. Tartar sauce. Has a strong dill flavor. Yes, there's like a dill, dill weed or something in there. Some French fries. Here you are. Yeah, I'll be right back. Look at that. That's my orange crush drink. So, I think we're gonna uh, we're gonna eat up this food and, and then we'll be back. I think we're gonna end the uh, video for a short period now while we enjoy our delicious meal. So, we'll see you in a little while. So, um, yeah, I ate it all. Nick's got some of his. I, uh, I had to take it. some. <laughs> Couldn't do it, but. Couldn't complete the whole thing. I ate all mine. I was really hungry. And, um, we were kind of up late last night. You know, doing things that you do on a Saturday night. That you stay up late for? You know, like rearranging my sock drawer, those kind of things. Or other things. But, uh, so, I could really use the food, so I ate it all. How about you? I tried to eat as much as I could. That's, that's what I got. But you know, I still feel good. There's no, there's no need to, like, you know, eat too much, but I just... I ate it all. I don't feel full either. Over full, you know. I feel satisfied. Very good. We um, we went on a mission today. We were looking for fried clams, and we drove probably 40 miles or so, 30 or 40 miles from where our starting point was. Made it all the way to the New Hampshire coast, to the ocean. Although we didn't film any of that because I was driving. But, um, there wasn't much to look at. Yeah, there wasn't a whole lot going on, really. A lot of people in the way. We'll definitely do more videos at the ocean as the weather gets warmer. Things are just starting to open up here because of, uh, you know, we're going from the winter into the beginning of spring. It's only May 3rd. May 3rd? May 3rd, I believe. Second. Second. Oh, I'm Russian. It's May 2nd. <laughs> so, uh, it's the beginning of uh, the warm weather season here in New England. And delicious meals. There'll be more to come. We haven't done much traveling around the country uh, just because of what's going on, the situation in the world. But... We're going to try to feature more videos. We haven't done a video since we put out the trailer uh, back about six months ago. We did the, the uh, channel trailer. If you haven't seen that, it's awesome. It's a, it's a, like an Indiana Jones type adventure. I recommend it. You should uh, tune in and look at that. But um, good times. Good times and, and more good times to come. So. We're at the Old Salt in Hampton, New Hampshire. 
and Lammy's in. Although we're not staying at the end, we're gonna start heading back. We may do a little more filming on the way. I don't know. I think we're gonna end the video here though. Okay. I wanna thank everybody for tuning in. I wanna thank Nick. Thanks for having me. Yeah. And um, come back often because we're gonna, like I said, we're gonna have a lot more um, videos traveling around New England, showing you some of the stuff here in the Northeast, the food and the sights and the libations. So I guess that's it for now. So we'll see you later.